instincts. A dog has to just obey his base instincts. But a man has base instincts that he can turn into higher things, right? You're Yo, Elliot. Yo, Elliot, since the beginning of the program, I've overpowered my ego and kept to a running schedule. Upon completing today's run, I was rewarded as a fit ass queen began her own jog in front of me. Oh. I was electrified by the view and the interesting experience that I then faced was the now visible pride within my sweatpants while he's running. So I think that means code for I had a boner. I think that's, I think that's what, what our man is dealing with. He was running and a girl walked, jogged in front of him and I got a boner. Um, my first instinct was to stop and hide it. Interesting. Uh, since it's now shameful for male energy to be on display. Yep, you don't want anybody seeing your boner. But thought, fuck that conditioning, and I passed her feeling powerful in charge. <laughs> May I have your thoughts? Uh, you, my thoughts are you did the right thing. You can't help what goes on down there, and you didn't make a big deal out of it either way. Like you could, you you could have made a big deal out of it. Like, hey, this means I need to talk to that girl, and you didn't make it that way. And of course, I guess where you were leaning first was to be ashamed. Like, oh boy, which I guess you know that's legit too. Right? I don't know. I don't know if you just could, like you could, but if you was interested and you want to talk to that girl, you got this big boner in your pants, uh, that might just be an interesting conversation, that's all. But you did the sexual transmutation move, right? You turned what was a high charge in your body, in your root system. Your balls are right down here. There was a high charge in your root system that you had no control over. It's just what it is. Of course, you have judgments about this girl in front of you. You call her a fit-ass queen. I wouldn't go so far. I don't know how you decided she's a queen, but you saw a nice-looking ass in front of you, right? So you saw a nice-looking ass in front of you, jogging, and the primal instinct strike. But... What does higher man do, right? When a lot of people, are so, they still say this. I can't believe people still say this, like in the comments of my videos sometimes. They say, we're just animals, right? We're just animals. Don't forget that you're an animal. No, I'm not an animal. I'm a man. What makes me a man is that I got right reason. I got rationale. I got intellect. I got an ego. Everyone wants to denigrate the ego, but the ego is what lets you be a man. A dog doesn't have an ego. A goat don't have an ego. A man has an ego which allows him to ascend by being higher than his, his base instincts. A dog has to just obey his base instincts. But a man has base instincts that he can turn into higher things, right? You're, what you did, let me tell you what I recognize what you did, he said. He said, I passed her feeling powerful and charged. You took that energy and you let it fuel your workout, right? Now, I know your brain was all hooked up, and you probably still, of course, you're sending me emails and stuff. You're, you're still attached to her. Part of your brain and a part of your balls is still attached to that woman. But for you to even be thinking about it all these days later. But you transcended. You ascended. You accelerated, picked up speed, and you just passed her. All right, that's all it is. Hey, I got some energy. You know what you do? Thank you, fit ass, for giving me a boost of energy. I'm out of here. And that's what you did, right? And you could have left her there too. You could have you could have ran past her and just completely left her, but you carried her with you. <laughs> She's still hanging out with you in your brain. That's why uh, that's why you asking me these questions and stuff. But you use you use the word pride. My now visible pride, I guess, which you mean is your boner, proud of your boner. And then you're also proud of yourself for overpowering your boner. So you get a double dose of pride, but be careful because you know what comes before the fall. And that's all I got to say about that, dude. Done. Yo, it's your bro, Elliot. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, you ought to know that it was a clip from the coaching sessions that I have every week with my King Transformation students where among other things, we get together for about four or five hours a week. And we talk all things related to becoming kings in our lives, in fitness, business, and with women. If that sounds like you and you want to join a like-minded group of men who are growing stronger every day in every way in this degenerate age, 
then it's real simple. Just follow me on Instagram and then DM me the word King, K-I-N-G. Me and my team will get back to the details and see if you qualify to join us. Hope to see you at our next meeting. Done.